Here's the evolution of Roblox cursors, and how to get them to use them today. In 2005, which also happens to be the first release of Roblox, the first ever cursor was used for it. It looked like a normal cursor, but it was very goofy, more tidal to the left and its line is much taller. It was designed so badly because this guy, David Basucki, created Roblox thinking it won't take off and become one of the most popular video games in history. It is also very iconic, as it's known for old Roblox. Many old Roblox replications use it to give the feeling of old Roblox, when it was actually good. If you want to use it now, here's how to do it. I'm gonna be using a Mac, but I've done it on a Windows before and it's pretty much the same. So go to the Roblox application file, and right click. Then click on Show Package Contents. Then click on Contents. Then click on Resources, then Content, then Textures, then Cursors, then Keyboard Mouse, then replace these files with the mouse cursor files you want, making sure they are the same name. I will link a file to download in the description for each cursor we'll talk about in this video. About 8 years later, in 2013, the most iconic Roblox cursor was created. This. It is by far the most loved cursor by the majority of the Roblox community. It is also the most recognizable one, and it has lasted for the longest time. It was also the simplest, having no line at all, just being a tilted triangle with a slight outline and a little empty thingy on the bottom. I don't really know what it's called. It also happens to be my personal favorite, not that you care about my opinion. It also looked pretty cool and unique. Unlike the other cursors which are just normal Steve Jobs style cursors with some slight changes. It also looked classic, giving you mixed feelings of modernity and nostalgia, all while feeling a pro at the same time. It has really been a very big part of Roblox, just like YouTube is a big part of my life. I literally spend most of my time making videos for you, so please subscribe if you would like to motivate me. Finally, the newest cursor to date was released in 2021. Yes, this literal piece of garbage. Not to be hating on the designers but like what the hell is this? Where is the creativity? It's just the average computer cursor with curves on the corners. I literally thought that Roblox wasn't loading the cursor texture when the update came out. I mean isn't the trend keeping things simpler these days? This just makes it like every normal cursor else, not simple or whatever that is. Now although I have roasted the hell out of this cursor, it's still an average cursor which is acceptable. I'm not against the mouse cursor design, I just expected much more creativity out of Roblox, not just straight out curvatures. We are used to it by now though. It has been almost 3 years since its release, and some people still use the trick I showed you at the beginning of the video to use the old cursors. I used to do that a while ago but I gave up because I literally had to change it every single update. And if you found this quick history lesson interesting, I think the downfall of Pet Simulator X would be even more interesting.